As Rhea is exploring jobs she might like to apply for later in the school year, she sees that many marketing jobs require a portfolio to demonstrate the quality of work she can produce. She is thrilled because she has plenty of work from her internship with marketing agency Better Together that will help her build a strong portfolio. Since she has time now before her semester begins, and she has all the work from Better Together that she has just completed, she decides this is a great time to start compiling her portfolio. First, she checks with her supervisor, Cindy, to make sure she has permission to showcase the work she has created for the different projects she's worked on at Better Together. Cindy agrees, but she cautions Rhea to make sure that none of the personal information of anyone involved in those projects is disclosed in any of her portfolio pieces. After receiving permission, Rhea goes through the pieces she has created and determines which three would best showcase her abilities. She decides on the social media fundraising flyer that she created for future leaders, her educational blog development outline for Environment First, and a project pitch slideshow that she created for a cancer research website. Now that she has decided on the pieces that she will use, she researches online portfolios that will make her work look the most professional. She browses several free digital platforms, and ultimately she is able to find a website that checks all her boxes and has some additional features she wants to experiment with. After watching a brief tutorial, she starts organizing her work until she finds a layout she is happy with. She realizes that the accomplishment statements that she created earlier will make perfect captions for the pieces she is including. Now that she has started her portfolio, she can continue to add work that she will create during her senior year. She feels confident that this important part of her job search process will be ready to go when she's ready to start applying.